Hi, Reality Wanted. Nigel Lithgow from So You Think You Can Dance here. Um, I'm really excited this season because we're bringing back 12 fantastic dancers and we're calling them the all-stars and it's across, we hoped it was going to be across six seasons of dance, it's actually across five, we haven't got anybody from season one, so we must rectify that next year. Uh, but bringing them back and using them as the dance genre for this year's competitors, I think is fantastic. Uh, I think it's very important, you've got to have great technique to be on this show, you've got to be easily adaptable, you've got to be able to pick up steps and choreography very quickly uh, and you've got to be in that position that you can grow across the Add to that fantastic personality, stage presence, charisma, the X factor, whatever you want to call it, uh, and that separates you uh, from everybody else. We're all unique in our own different way. Uh, you've got to show that uniqueness within your dancing. A serious question, this season you are going to be going around to the homes of the kids and you're going to have to say to them that they are either in the program or they will not be in the program in their homes. Is that a daunting task? To tell, to actually have the potential experience of ripping some young dancers hopes and dreams away from them in front of their friends and family is something I couldn't even have dreamed possible, it sounds so thrilling. Because to watch dreams crushed is the most exciting thing that I could possibly imagine doing. It's horrible! You don't want to do that, you, and, and um, I'm still infuriated that, that's, that you're making us do it. Um, is it true that you are and have been asked to audition as the next American Idol judge, replacing Simon Cowell? No comment.